Okay, so let's talk about stress incontinence first. The most important thing to understand about stress incontinence is that it always happens with activity. It's a physical external pressure on the bladder. So if I have a water balloon here and I squish it from the outside and I force uh, water to come out the opening, that's stress incontinence. So it absolutely always, 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 always will happen with some sort of movement. The most common things are cough, laugh, sneeze. It can be something as mild as standing up from a sitting position or walking across the room, but it will never happen while you're sitting perfectly still. It is the most common type of incontinence among women and is very, very common. 15 million American women have stress urinary incontinence. These are some of the activities that we talked about or that I just mentioned, but exercise is a real common one. You know, jumping jacks, jumping on a trampoline, cough, laugh, sneeze, throwing up, those kinds of things. Standing up from a chair can, can be it, but it's always with movement.